Welcome back to the show, everyone. Favorite day of the week. We have a cat from River Cities and Amber Meaves, too. Thank you for being here. Yeah, thanks for having us. This is Dot. This is Dot. And he, he's just like, why did you wake me up this early? Yeah, no, he was not amused with the waking up part for this today. He was not amused with my driving to get here. He's missing his cup of catnip. He's just not having a good day overall. But he is a perfect little boy. He was permanent earlier. He loves to be pet. Uh, and tell me a little bit about him. Yeah, no, so he's a five-month-old little boy. He's very, very friendly, despite him being a little camera shy at the moment. He's decided he wants to try and hide on my shoulder. There he is. <laughs> you see how his camera? There we go. There's a good nice shot. <laughs> and people can adopt him, and you said he even has a brother, so. Uh, he has a sister. A sister, okay. <laughs> he has a sister who's still with us at the shelter. His brother did get adopted. Okay, wonderful. Uh, so, we, honestly, we'd love for them to go as a pair because they're, they're great friends, but they're available separately as well. Okay, and so for people who would like to adopt, what's that process like? So they can come in the building, they can come meet Dot any day. We're open for today from noon to six. We're open for tomorrow noon to six. <laughs> Wonderful, so Tuesday through Saturday. Yes. And I know fostering is something so important. We talked about it the last time you were here. Um, it's vital to make sure you can take even more pets into the shelter. Yeah, we always need foster. Right now I'm looking for uh, a slight medical foster. Okay. Uh, it's for a single kitten. He just needs a little extra care. Um, but we always need fosters for moms and kittens, litters of kittens, bottle baby kittens. We get hundreds of calls and we just want to help as many as we can. And so when you say um, medically needy foster, you know, what does that entail? So it depends on the foster, but this one, he has a, um, a messed up eye, so he needs eye meds in his eye twice a day. <laughs> okay, so just a little something to help him get the care he needs to find his forever home. Yes. And something else, there's a huge fundraiser coming up. Yes, we have our biggest fundraiser of the year, Tales at Twilight. It is October 26th at Bayou Point from 6.30 to 10.30. You can buy our, your tickets on our website. And if you're interested in becoming a sponsor, we're still doing sponsorships at the moment. Okay, wow, so people still have time to get in on that. Yeah. And um, what can people expect at the event? So it's a big, it's a really fun event. It's our biggest event of the year, as you said. It's mm -hmm. a costume gala, and we do a costume contest every okay. year. And of course, there are prizes for best costume. And we, uh, we have food included, drinks are included this year, I'm pretty sure. Okay. Um, we, you know, we've got games. It's just an overall, it's a fun night, and it supports all of our little furry friends. <laughs> it supports the cat shelter and all the endeavors, and I love him. He's just looking up. He says he sees something right now. Yeah, no, I think he's real interested in the screen behind me, right? <laughs> and I hope he finds a home super fast after this interview, because he is so soft. You can't see that at home or feel him at home, but he is just <laughs> the softest, sweetest little buddy. Thank you so much for being with us. We're going to have all the information about how to adopt Dot on our website, canwe.com.